Hey, it's Randy from UC Status. Today I'm going to record a really short video for someone who's a little bit stuck. I'm going to see if I can help that person out, and I'm going to post this in a minute. So, the dilemma. <clears throat> You've seen my videos on the Logitech Rally Bar before. The Rally Bar is up there on the shelf. Here's the, the main screen, and I've got the top console there. I'm going to go through that in a sec. What happens if you change service provider and you don't know how to change back? When you're in appliance mode, it's quite easy. You know, even if you don't have the, the tap console, you can use a remote to, to go down to the more button and then into settings and, and, and it's quite obvious. If you do have the tap console, it's also quite obvious. You just tap, tap the more button and again, go into settings. But what happens if you're in BYOD mode? There is no discernible way to actually get into that, that mode change. If you look at the, the, the front of room screen here, it just says plug in your cables. Also, you can see back here, on the tap console, it says exactly the same thing. It's a mirror of what's on the front of room screen. So what do you do? You just tap the screen until it actually comes to life? No. What you do is hopefully you've got the actual um, the rally bar remote control. So what I'm going to do is press the center button or the select button and the call end button or call answer end button there for about five seconds, I think. Now it changes into another mode. You can see it says continue to set up on the Logitech tab. If I didn't have a tap console, it would actually just pop up on here, the actual password. All right, so I'm just gonna show you again, just holding the remote. Press the select button in the middle of the D-pad and the call answer end button. One, two, three, four, five, and it switches modes. Now you can see you've got the system settings here. I'm actually already authenticated. Um, it would normally pop up and ask for a password, but now here you can actually just go about your business, just go into system there, and you can see you've got all your BYOD settings here. You can see the service provider here is set to BYOD. And if you scroll up, down here it says change service provider. I'm just going to go ahead and tap on that and it'll find all the service providers that are valid on this system. And I'm just going to tap on Teams. It switches to kind of a little dark layout. And then I'm going to press Next. Now it says Applying Service Provider. It gives you the instructions on how to, to fix that Teams sticker that's just there. It'll connect to the company portal and now it just wants a password. So I'm just going to try and do this upside down. You pop in the code, the authentica authentication broker kicks in, and it goes through the device registration on the company portal. All right, now it's finally finished that, and it's come with Teams. Again, a little recap. If you get stuck between modes or something like that, and you want to get into the menu um, uh, of things, basically on the Logitech Rally remote, you just hold down the select button in the middle of the D-pad, and the call answer end button for about five seconds and it'll pop up a password prompt and you'll be able to get into your settings. Hopefully that's been useful for the person that absolutely needs it and maybe it's useful for somebody else you know that might be stuck, right? Thanks very much, bye for now.